Well, we are expecting a decision soon on the fate of Shelby Township Police Chief Robert Shalai. Chief was placed on leave earlier this month for a series of inflammatory tweets on a personal Twitter account. The township board is in the middle of a third hearing. Mara McDonald live in Shelby Township. Mara, if my math is right, we are now four hours into this hearing. Where does it stand? Devin, you, your math is absolutely right, and here's where we're at. The township board is discussing what to do with the chief right now, and while no final vote has been taken, they're hashing it out right now, it does appear there are at least five votes out of seven on this township board to suspend him without pay for 30 days and send him to sensitivity training, not fire him. Then again, final vote hasn't been taken, but right now, that's what it looks like. Let me take you through it. Chief Shalai addressing the township board in the last half hour, explaining his perspective on these tweets. Then I started seeing my brothers in blue being assassinated, shot in the back of the head, murdered in cold blood, stabbed, beaten, shot, run over. And this was going on in numerous locations around the country. Because of COVID-19, Township Hall is closed, which meant this meeting was done via Zoom. If he truly doesn't represent you, prove it. Do something about it. You say the chief's words don't represent you, but your lack of action, empathy, and sincerity go against that. The chief's actions lead to only one conclusion. He needs to be fired, and he needs to find a new line of work. Hundreds were on the Zoom call. Easily more than half were from out of the township, which was an issue for those who do live here. I'm sick and tired of all these people who don't even live in Shelby Township criticizing what we do in Shelby Township. Shalide's inflammatory tweets came from a private Twitter account and deal with the civil unrest around the country. Those who support him view those tweets as directed at rioters and looters. Those who want him fired view them as racist. He's literally attacking human lives. I don't care what color they are. It's, it's body bags of body, right? So this is a man who chose to violate our community's police policies. Back here live, we are still monitoring this meeting, which is still going on at this late hour. We expect a vote maybe within the next 20 minutes or so. But as I said, it does appear right now that there are five votes out of seven that would allow the chief to remain on the job, but take a 30 day suspension without pay and have to go to sensitivity training. But stand by. Things can change on a dime. We'll update you through the newscast. We're live in Shelby Township tonight. I'm Mara McDonald. Back to you. Hopefully back to you soon. All right, Mara.